Greetings and welcome back to the workshop. Hope you're all doing marvellously well. Today we're going to be looking at angles. Angles to bolt the frames together for the steam engine project. Usually you just use off the shelf angle iron and it's never ever 90 degrees. Using the old square we've got a little a little bit of rocking. Now, unfortunately the camera it is it is very small and the camera won't actually pick this up but it's there. So today we're going to use this small machine to take off a very small cut. I don't have a face mill cutter so I'm going to have to use the largest one I can find in the box. So it might be two passes. I also don't have coolant so who knows how this is going to end up. Now I'm going to put a strip because obviously we've got the inside corner here and this is square edged I'm not saying that this is how you should do this because I've never done this before there's only one thing that can go wrong it going wrong so I'm going to put a strip of metal at the back clamp it in the vise turn the right handle that would help wouldn't it now it should cut more off this back edge here I'll have a go eh now what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring it down so it just touches this front edge and then we'll just have a see, see what it, if it takes anything off from the back because I don't want to take too much off because obviously I've drilled all the holes Perfect. Right, so there we go. I could have probably got a better finish on it than that. I'll probably adjust the speed. But I don't think we've, we've not taken off very much. I don't think we've not taken a millimetre off. Uh, just where's the square? Now, these that's now perfect. Absolutely perfect. I don't know if you can. See if we can capture that on the screen. Before we had a rock. Now we have nothing. Perfect all the way along. So right. So I've just got another nine to do. And then these will be ready. Uh, I'll have to do a quick deburr on that on that hole. Uh, so yeah another nine to do and then these will be ready for painting and ready for the assembly so uh, I'll see you in nine
there we go, they're all done. They're all 90 degrees. Now I'd suggest that if your angle isn't 90 degrees to start with, machine it first before you put the holes in. We could encounter slight alignment issues. I've only taken around 0.3 of a mil off, to be honest, on the thicker side. Uh, when you measure the thickness, the two thicknesses, it's about 0.3 on average different so they're ready now to uh, have a look at paint on but more of that in the next video if you do like what you've seen on the channel so far please do click the like button and you'll be helping spread the video further afield in YouTube and you'll be doing the channel a big favor so until next time laters I better get the Uber and clean up. <sighs>